hello everyone welcome to family first one video welcome wherever you are watching welcome if today is your first time watching family first one video please we need your subscribe like comment and continue to follow us those are already they subscribe continue to follow us share like continue thank you god bless you Today I'm here to cook the water green. This is the water green. This is the water green. This is the water green. So this is the water green I will be cooking with country beans. And this is the country beans. The country beans are already did the first step. So now it wouldn't need to put together. And I will be using the tobacco oil. This is the tobacco oil I will be using. These are the ingredients you are seeing here. I will be putting together to put to make the water green country beans. So these are the ingredients. And the season will be followed as usual. I will be putting the season step by step. Every time to put the season, you will be seeing me. I will put the season and I will show it to you. These are the ingredients I will be putting together. So the cooking begin with cleaning. Now I'm going to start cleaning. Continue to follow the video until the end. So now I am cleaning. I have done cleaning the chicken, the raw chicken, dry one, and the dry bony. This is a casking. I love putting casking in the water green. And I will advise you to, when you're doing your cooking, Use a casting in the water green, it will make it thick and you will add the taste. This is a chicken food or this one. It can make water green to set down good when you make a cooking. So this is a airplane. Those tilly things when you use them in the water green, it will make your water green to get taste that you will like. So continue to see I'm feeling continuously. So now I have done cleaning. These are the cleaning items that I will be using. So this is the fish, chicken food, chicken breast, rough chicken, dry chicken, dry bony. These are all in here. This is a cow skin. I will advise you if you're cooking water green, you put cow skin in it. It will make your water green to sit good when you are mixing it. It will sit down good and you will add the taste. This is a cow skin. It's easy to cook. A in African store, you can get it in any African store. They are already cleaner in like this. It only need to wash and put it in like this. So these are the ingredients I will start with cooking. And I'm leaving this one out yet. I will do it later. But these are the first ones that are going on fire. So I put it on the stove. So I put in the stove on so it can buffer some millet. Because the cooking, if the cooking look heavy, I don't know how heavy your own will be looking. So I can show you the millet that will be boiling because I'm cooking heavy soup. So this is the soup that will be cooking. So it will only buffer some millet. Then I will come back to it. So now I am setting it on the stove. And I'm putting the stove on so I can let it boil for some minute. How much your cooking will be looking, that how you can let it to stay on the fire. Because if it's cooking low heavy, it will take time to boil. If it's small, that just how it will boil faster. So I'm only letting it to boil for some minute. So I can show you the minute how long it will be. So I am cooking it now. So it can boil for some minute. It's a water green. Before cutting it, you need to wash it first before you can do the cutting. You, when you're cutting it, you can use a bowl to cut. If you know how to cut on bowl, something on bowl, you use the bowl to cut on it. But me, I can use the knife with my hand. I do the cutting and you will see me how I'm going to do. So I'm taking this one away, the biggest one. 
Then you see the hidden where I take from. If you want to do like me, this is how. On the cutting, you have to be careful. And if you know how to use your bow, continue with the bow. Because even you cutting, cut medium, it will be melt. Everything can melt. So this is how I can do the cutting. So you can use a bow before you cut yourself if you don't use with this. But if you want to practice the same cutting, you can do it the, the, the way I'm doing right now. So now I have waited it for the fish and the meat to boil for some minutes. So I'm getting the fish, the raw fish out. So the rest will leave in a pot. And this is a country beans. I am talking about. Like I just said, I did the first step on it. So this is an airplane. So I am putting them now. These are the things that you need to put right now. If you Boil the meat and the fish. You don't need too much of water. And this is a water green. So I'm placing the water green. I already put the airplane and the beans. So I'm putting the water green right now. This is a water green. You cut a medium, everything will melt. So you don't need to cut it small, small. When you like, you can cut it like that, but like I just said, it will melt. So I'm closing it so it can boil for some millet. So I let it boil for some millet. Like I just said, you don't need plenty of water, you see? If you put too much of water, it becomes water, water soup. So this water that in it, it will let it done good. So now this is a dry swim, dry kuta, dry pork fish, and the pepper that I want to add in it. So this is the time that I need to put them, and this is the time you need to put this thing, this ingredient that I'm putting right now. And this is the pepper, onion, I'm adding the salt. The corn vita, I'm using four. But like I just said, I'm cooking the soup a heavy. If you're cooking small, you can use one or two. Yeah. So I will be using four for my cooking. But this is the time for you to put them. Because I add all the seasoning uh, ingredients in the soup. So I need to add all the seasoning that I need right now. And this is the other seasoning. So I will not set it, the soup right now. I will cover it so it can pour for some milk. It will be covered for some milk. So the seasoning and the, the ingredient that I put under it, so the seasoning can go in it. And 
I am checking on the Subaru right now. So I will let it boil for some minutes again. So now I have waited for the soup to boil for some minutes. You see, and it has airplane in it. So the water is enough for now. So I am placing the water on now. So I am using the tobogi oil, like I just said. This is a tobogi oil. So I am putting the oil. And I'm putting the fish that I got out of it. The fish that ball. So the oil can go in it too. it so you can pour for the oil to go in the fish and other stuff so this is the water that you need to leave in it then smaller water because as you can see the airplane in it so the soup is done so I am lowering the fire down to the smaller level so it can set, then I can do the last step. So I load the fire. So this is a country solar and I have put it in the water already, it already been soaked. This You would use small and the water small like you can see it. This is the powder on. I'm coming to place them now. This is the last step. This is the tobacco soil that you will like to eat. Water green. Country beans. Take one. This is a powder on. You don't use them that much. This is the last step on the cooking. I wish you could be around in the house here yeah, so you can taste the cooking. You will like to cook it like this every time. You see it? You see? 